My mic was muted the whole time. Really? Yeah. It was alright. It was a mid episode anyway. <gasps> hey guys, I recorded this entire reaction muted, but I have the SML question here for you. What is the worst dare you've ever done? Uh, Hermes has killed a man, and I really don't think I've ever been dared to do anything, so I honestly don't know. I always picked truth when we played truth or dare. No? I got in trouble in sixth grade because someone dared me to slap someone. I walked up to this kid. I don't know why I didn't like him. Uh, I think we were both neurodivergent and I could sense it. So I was like, I don't like you. You're dumb like me. So uh, they dared me to go up to him and slap him. And I did, right? But I didn't accept, I, I, I didn't expect him to clap back. He slapped me, but he missed. But he got the very edge of my glasses and my glasses went flying across the room. And upon realizing what he had done, he was like, oh, and he ran out of the room. And I remember chasing him down. This all sounds fabricated, but if you know anyone who went to middle school with me, you can ask him about this. Ask him about the, like ask him about the chubby black man running down on the hall, screaming, come back here, you motherfucker. Yes, I enunciated motherfucker. I had to make sure he knew that I was calling him someone who fucks their own mom. Uh, so anyway, uh, we got pulled into the principal's office and the principal was like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? Like, there's no reason to be doing this in school. I didn't even get detention or anything, but like after we went out, I did some really like stupid anime shit where I was like, you know what? He's right. Why are we fighting? Let's start over. Hi, I'm Brandon. And he went along with it, but he did not talk to me for like the rest of the year. So yeah, uh, that's the answer to the SML question. I'm going to slap this at the beginning of the next video so you guys know that, uh, know what happened. Bye, see you in the reaction. Go to the reaction. Will you please let me be professional? Oh, you're starting? Yes. God damn. <gasps> How's it going, Tube Tech students? It's your boy, Diddles, and I would like to welcome you back to another episode of SML Hit or Miss. In this series, I either watch new SML or an episode that you guys recommend, and I delegate whether or not it is a hit or a miss. Today, we have the episode SML Movie Jeffy the Wrestler. I, I don't know how they came up with this. I'm not even going to try to guess how they came up with it. We got Jeffy holding a hammer, which is very much illegal in wrestling. Um, and he's fighting someone who looks like Ahmed the Dead Terrorist, so... Yeah, uh, I don't know. I'm gonna say this one's gonna be a miss. Do you agree with me? Let me know down in the comment section and let's jump right into the ha ha funny SML. Let's go. So guys, you ready to watch the WWE fight tonight? Yeah! Hell yeah. I thought I recently Bogart's heard it's not Jeffrey called WWE giraffe. anymore. Wait, Jeffy the Giraffe from Toys R Us? Yeah. Oh, Jeffy's gonna get his ass beat, dude. Well, I'm gonna go for Jeffrey. Well, I want Bone Crusher to win. He always wins. Yeah, he crushes bones, dude. Well, let's turn it on so we can watch. I don't think you're allowed Hello to crush the bones Hello and welcome to the WWE Championship. Today, it's Bone Crusher versus Jeffrey the Giraffe. I'm glad they still have that suit. Jeffrey. Come on, Jeffrey. Let's go, Bone Crusher! Crush the bones! The winner gets this championship belt! Let the fight begin! Come here, Jeffrey! Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, he's got that's the very stool. much illegal. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Ouch. Oh, Bone Crusher's not playing today. He's trying to crush his skull with a stool. I got something special for you, Jeffrey. Are you ready for some bone crushing? I don't think he's ready. Bone crushers open neck. up a can of whoop ass. Help! Help! Where you think you're going? Help! Come back here. Help! Where you going? Oh, oh shit. Time for the dragon, bro. He's putting SmackDown on that man. It's over. Damn, Booty. Calm down. Bone Crusher's the champion. I told you I could do it. I told you I would win. Bone Crusher wins. Yay! I told you 
Bone Crusher was gonna beat Jeffrey? Jeffrey. This is not fair. Bone Crusher's too good. He's undefeated. Well, I could beat him. No, you couldn't. Yes, I could. It'd be easy. Well, there's no way they'll ever let some stupid kid versus Bone Crusher. Hey, kids, have you ever wanted to fight Bone Crusher? I sure wouldn't. Well, we're having a charity event with the Mana Food Bank, and whoever can donate the most cans of food gets a can of whoop ass in the ring with Bone Crusher. Damn right. So donate as many cans of food as you can today. Oh my god, Jeffy, look! There's a chance you can fight Bone Crusher! All you have to do is donate a bunch of cans of food. Well, I don't have a bunch of cans of food. Beans. All right, Jeffy, it's time for dinner. Come on. Oh, oh my god, I gotta go eat dinner. I'll be back. Okay, Jeffy, okay. here's your dinner. Green beans. I'm so grateful. And we went to the store and bought you a month's supply of food. Jeez, you really shouldn't have. You know I don't like green beans, so I don't know why he does know do you do it. Don't like at green this beans. point, it's child Girl, abuse. You, Marvin, why do you keep it giving them green beans? It is child abuse at because this point. Because they're good for him. False. This sodium in here is 380 milligrams, which is enough to put me in cardiac arrest before my 21st birthday. Oh, Jeffy, shit. just shut up and eat them. Come on, baby, let's go. You only buy these so they end up on the floor. So let's start with that. Wow, that is a lot of cans of food. I it could is? turn those in and fight Bone Crusher. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, check okay. out all these cans of food. Wow, Jeffy, that's so many green beans. I bet if you donated all those green beans, they'd let you fight Bone Crusher. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. And lose? I'm not gonna lose. I think you guys are underestimating my R strength. Well, wait, how oh, do we they donate those cans? Like, where do we okay. go? Yeah, I'll just call sense. up the WWE Association and tell them to come get their beans. Hey there, I'm Steve Staleberger. I represent the WWE. Why'd you call me? Because I wanted to turn in all these cans of green beans to fight Bone Crusher. Holy moly, that's a lot of cans. You it win. Sure you get to fight Bone Crusher. Wait, he wins? No one else donated cans? No, nobody else donated cans because they don't want to fight Bone Crusher. They don't want to <laughs> die. Well, I'm going to win. Makes sense. Okay, whatever you say, kid, as long as you sign all the waivers. Now, Why I'm going to collect all these cans. Just hold on, let me go pop me. my trunk. Wow, Jeffy, you get to fight Bone Crusher. Are you nervous? No, because I know I'm going to win. Oh, ma make room. He has to get the cans. So what's your wrestling <laughs> name going to be? My what? Your wrestling name. You need a scary wrestling name like Bone Crusher. Sure, he has a scary name. Yeah. Um, mine could be Poopy Diaper. Well, that's not very intimidating. Well, it is when there's a grumpy in my diaper. Dude, True. it has to be something cool. Yeah, something scary. Yeah, like heart disease. That's not scary, Cody. Oh, well, God, heart one disease. Of the death rest in America. Well, how about something like the big bad wolf, and you dress up like a wolf, and then you can say, I'm gonna huff, and I'm gonna puff, and I'm gonna beat your ass. Ooh, I'm that's fine, dude. Blow you. Okay. Yeah, Jeffy, so go dress up like a wolf, and then go fight him. I, I promise you, you'll be scary. All right. Hello and welcome to another WWE World Championship. Tonight, Bone Crusher has decided to donate his belt to whoever wins. So in this corner, we have Bone Crusher. Your bones yeah, are gonna get bone crushed crusher. today. And in this corner, the Big Bad Wolf. I'm gonna huff and puff and knock your ass out. Okay, let the fight begin. You ready to die, kid? I'm gonna kick your ass! Oh, Get shit. Off me! You know who I am? I'm Bone! Oh, uh, fuck! Okay, that's it! No more going easy on you! Uh, Alright, you yes, ready? Yeah. Oh, God, not the stool! Oh, Jeffy, use the stool! Okay, that kid's gonna die! Okay! That's straight oh, up a hammer. That's a legal. With the claw hammer. I don't know if that's legal, folks. It's not. All right, he's gonna die. Screw this. Uh, ah! Hey, kid, stop. You know this is off a show, right? It's wrestling. It's fake. You're going a little too hard. It's You're actually starting wrestling. to hurt me. You're not gonna trick me, Bone Crusher. No, no kid, stop. Jesus, fuck. No. Ah! 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 the chair this might be over early folks uh hey man do you want me to stop this because oh, he's kicking your ass yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> don't grab him by the throat like that jeffy please <laughs> oh from the top of the ropes that's gotta hurt listen kid Hang on. just pick up my leg and tap me out it's over you win and you kick me in your face i'm not falling for that bone crusher where's he going someone tell me where he's going where's he going oh my god not the ladder dear lord he has the ladder 
Are you ready to die, fucker? No. Jesus Christ. Please don't do it. No. 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 Oh. One, two, three. He's dead. Jesus Christ. The big bad wolf wins. The you would think that by murder disqualifies him, considering he went in the wolf. ring and yeah, murdered an actor. Yeah, I those three little pigs that I would win. Wow, Jeffy wasn't lying. He really kicked Bone Crusher's ass. Like, he killed him. Hey, guys, check out my new belt. I got that W. Jeffy, why'd you go so hard? You killed the guy. Well, he was asking for it. You do know wrestling's fake, right? Oh, I didn't know that. But then you... Breaking news, okay? Dad at 32. Crusher, a famous wrestler has died. His funeral will be held tonight for anyone who wants to attend. Oh, wow, he's actually dead. I thought maybe he was faking it. <laughs> no, I felt his neck snap. Oh, oh man, God. now my favorite wrestler's dead. Oh, R.P. Bone Crusher. Wow, Jeffy, good going. You killed Joseph's favorite wrestler. Well, I didn't mean to. We should go to his funeral. Yeah, let's go to Bone Crusher's funeral. Oh, God. Amazing grace, how sweet. This is a very specific feeling, but this is make me wanting to go to one of those old school churches, like the one where it's like seven rows of pews and like a single steeple like out front. And it's like in the middle of butt fuck nowhere. It's like you're, you had to drive down like five miles on a country road to even reach it. You don't even know how they have like power out there. They don't. They have like chandeliers with like little uh, candles in them. Okay. That saved a wretch like me. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to like mourn the loss soulful, of our beloved bone like crusher, him. whose bones were ironically crushed in his last wrestling match. Would anyone like to say anything before we bury him six feet under? <laughs> <laughs> There's something I want to say. There is one thing I would like to say about Bone Crusher. I don't believe he's dead! <laughs> Jeffy! Oh, put him down! God, the horror! The horror! He's oh already been God. embalmed Jesus, and everything! No, stop! Jeffy, stop it! Oh, God! Marvin, Jeffy ate all his green beans! He really did? Yes, he ate every can! Still every not can? Jeffy wouldn't eat that much! Jeffy, get in here! Hey there, your son's under arrest. For yeah. what? Well, he killed the guy and then beat up the guy's corpse <laughs> at the funeral. Jeffy, why would you do that? Oh, he actually committed a whole alphabet list of crimes. Here, I'll oh, name them all for you. A is for aggravated assault. B is for beating a corpse. C is for choking a corpse. D is for defiling the dead. E is for extortion because he called the guy's parents afterward and then asked for money or else he'd kill them. <laughs> F is for felonious activity because I'm pretty sure what he did is a felony. G is for grave robbing. H is for hate crime because Bone Crusher had a little bit of black on him, but he's oh, also God. a skeleton, so I don't really know how that works. I is for ignoring the law. J is for jaywalking really because the when they tried alphabet. to arrest him, he crossed the street, but he didn't use a crosswalk. K is for killing. L is for larceny, and I don't know what that means, but it sounds bad. M is for murder. N is for neglect. O is for, oh my God, how could you do that to a corpse? <laughs> P is for personal injury. Q is for quite ridiculous what he did. R is for resisting arrest. S is for strangulation. <laughs> T is for threatening because he threatened me when I tried to arrest him. U is for under the influence because he must be, because why else would he do that? V is for violence. W is for why would anyone do that? X is for xylophone because he played the guy's ribs like a xylophone. Jesus y Christ. is for why would you do that? Again, why would anyone do that? And Z is for zebra stripes because he's going to be wearing black and white stripes when he's in jail. Jeffy, why would you do all those things? Because I got this shiny belt for beating up Bone Crusher. Oh, is that real? Yep. I've always wanted a WWE belt. Hmm. Okay, I'll tell you what. No way, I, I will drop that all these charges real. if you give me that I belt. Refuse to believe Wait, I real. won this fair and square. Jeffy, give him the damn belt. I know SML okay. has the money to flex Ooh, and buy so like cool. an authentic WWE Here, belt. Take it. Oh, but sweet. I, I refuse they would do that and do oh, it Jeffy, as a tax. Jeffy, I cannot believe you did all that, but I, I, you got really lucky that he wanted your stupid That's belt. Like right, one a, more question. Did you really eat all your green beans? Did you check the floor? Ooh, you goober. Ooh, you goober. SML question, who is your favorite WWE wrestler? These niggas think I watch WWE. Hey, Maddie. 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 Bitch. Ooh. It's The Undertaker. 
I actually did used to watch a lot of WWE and Raw uh, whenever I went down to Florida for the summer to stay with my granddad and uncle. And uh, my uncle loved wrestling. That's all he would watch. He would sit on the sofa all day and just watch wrestling. I know that sounds bad and makes him sound like uh, words that I won't say, but I am omitting information from this story that would make you say, oh, never mind. But yeah, uh, I really liked The Undertaker. He was the first wrestler I ever saw. And my granddad was like, I can do that. And I was like, no way, really? And my granddad stands up. And mind you, he's like seven foot. Oh my God. And he used to look so much taller because I was shorter. I just wanted to make sure you guys <laughs> knew that. <laughs> but he was like seven feet tall and he would put on this like hat and then he would roll his eyes to the back of his head. And I'm like, whoa. That was so cool, and that's why I like The Undertaker. Guys, you'll never believe what she said, and then she said she didn't want to. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this was a pretty decent episode. I would give it mid, but there were a couple jokes in it that actually made me laugh, so... For that alone, I'm giving this episode the rating of hit. Do you agree with me? Let me know down below. So with that being said, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you would like to see me do next. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified of the next time I upload. Don't forget to join the Discord server and check out the merch down in the description. And hey, while you're down there, why not donate to the Patreon to help tube and Dairy Dairy come out sooner. So with that being said, until next time, diddle out. But what is